When I grow up, I'm going to be a teacher. I plan to go to college. There's an entire generation of children whose potential is being lost, whose voices will not be heard if they don't get that quality education. If you grow up in a poor neighborhood and don't graduate from high school, you have no shot at participating in the 21st century life. They deserve a quality education and they've been cheated out of one. Teach for America's mission is to ensure that all children have the opportunity to receive an excellent education. You're going to write down as many features you could think of for that type of functional text and as many examples. I came out of a low-income community. My parents immigrated here. They didn't speak English. So I really wanted to come into the classroom and say, here I am as an example. Like, if I could do it, you could do it. Short term, you want to get talented people into the classroom right now to help close the achievement gap. And I think the long-term goal is that after you do your two years, you'll either stay in the classroom, be a great teacher, or you can go into other areas. But you'll still be mindful of the work that you did in your commitment. When I was in Teach for America, I was 22 years old and I was CEO of my classroom. It's the first thing I talk about in any interview because it defined so clearly how I think about the world. Teach for America is building a movement across this country to eliminate educational inequity. And we need every single one of you to make the commitment to be a part of this. One individual can make a serious difference in the lives of children. And one of the great hopes for America at a time when we're so troubled as a nation is Teach for America. I was thinking to be a nurse because I really like helping people. I'm gonna be a dentist. Sorry. This president.